Hello and welcome to the 87 Legends series. We are at Legacy Pocono here today, getting ready to get started with qualifying. And uh, we are the number one car. However, we are not the fastest car. We've got a couple guys that are faster. Um, I know that both the two, the four, and uh, I think one other guy had faster laps in the practice beforehand. But uh, we're holding our own, doing all right. Um, I gotta remember to set this back to here. That's where I found that I liked it. Getting plenty of turn with the brakes as we head out here to all-time optimal. I'm not sure if we can reach the all-time optimal. I think that's uh, a little bit ambitious. We might be able to get close though. The all-time optimal, uh, the best lap was set, I believe, uh, in an earlier iteration of this car, so might be harder to reach that, but hey, we'll have it up for reference anyway. First step here is not to wear the tires out on the outlap, because by the time we get to uh, turn two here, we're going about 170, and uh, that'll wear up the tires. We're going to brake a whole lot, slow way down, and then worry about getting our run to the line here out of three. This car, of course, really prefers that first lap so really important to get these tires as fresh as possible as we head out for our lap would be a good decent run up green, to the green, line green. okay here comes your first time lap it should be good enough can't overdrive it here Right, not bad. I kind of like that second line uh, laying up right there. Heading through one. I think maybe this old time was set with a uh, draft or something too, because that was a lot of speed. Heading through straight away. Through the tunnel turn, all about keeping it smooth. And maybe missed the turn a little bit there, but not too bad. I think I'm going to be happy with this lap. 59.7. Not bad at all. I'm happy with that. That's about as fast as I was running in the open practice, so we'll take it. And then uh, we'll see how the start of this lap looks. But I don't think we're going to have very much speed. As you can see, the tires are already not quite as grippy as we would like them to be. The 11 setting a very nice time. They're only a tenth back of us. All the guys that we know are going to be faster than us, though. Not yet putting times in. We'll see about that. I noticed that we're actually getting on the right rear. Um, and while I was practicing, so that's going to be really interesting. I think during the race, I'm going to try to be easy on the uh, throttle on the exits. Still try to get a good run, because that's going to be important here at Pocono, but at the same time, we don't want to be sliding through the corners late in the race either, so. Bit of a lower strength of field one here. We got a 2.3k um, listed here on Race Lab. And I guess we'll just do a practice pit in since we're going to have to wait for everybody to put their laps in anyway. Good handful of laps there, but still the guys that are faster than me not showing up there. So either they're not qualifying or they're waiting a little bit so they can uh, steal it from me <laughs> a little bit later. It's good to be in the 59s though. I think if you can get a sub minute time, you're in good shape. Wrap this bottom line here. And gotta be careful getting on the brakes with that uh, very far back brake bias. And that should be a decent stop. So there's the four. He's one of the guys I knew was gonna usurp me from the top spot. Is it usurp or 
usurp. Is that a what kind of you in that word is it? I don't know. And there's another one of those guys that expected to pass us. So I'm um, kind of turning out how I kind of expected. They just took a moment before putting their lap in. And then uh, everybody's got about five seconds, so. Looking like we are going to get this P3. Happy with that. I will definitely okay, take it. Session, P3. Don't know if we're going to be able to keep up with the uh, two guys ahead. But we're going to try. Draft is, of course, going to be a big thing here. I'm interested to see what the 11's got. He's pretty darn fast. And uh, a couple of these guys here, not too far off either, so... Especially with that draft, we could have a pretty, uh, pretty big fight on our hands. One to go. Next time by, line up on the inside. Pit road is closed right now. Some last lap. Fifty laps SOS here. There's your exact strength of field. Uh, we won't have enough fuel to make it to the end, so we'll have to prepare ourselves for pitting. It will be necessary. Whether it's under yellow or under green conditions. I think a top five would be nice here today. But uh, even better would be to finish up my starting position or better. But that would take uh, quite a very good run, I think, to pull that off. Two sets of tires. If we do pit under green conditions, I think we'll be taking those right sides only. Usually works well in this car but with it getting loose I think maybe uh, if we do get a yellow we'll take all four depending on what the situation is we'll make that decision as it comes not hear the 20 I got this unmuted don't I? yes so hopefully it will be a good one there are two. See the field here. A lot of end names. From 7th to 10th, we've got Mason, Marcus, Michael, and Michael. And then Matthew <laughs> down there as well. Lots the of end names. The air temp is 78 Fahrenheit, 50 laps. I think the guy ahead's got multiple accounts. In the inside column. So I think if he were... If you want to take the over-under on uh, 11... I get 11 yellows. Oh god, we're expecting a lot of yellows, huh? Uh, I'm gonna say 6. Going for the under. Optimistic. Huh. Yeah. I'll take the under too. I think if we do get somewhat of a good green run, we might get spread apart enough that we can avoid too many issues, but maybe I'm just being optimistic. Damn, why am I so negative? <laughs> <laughs> You're just being realistic. I don't know. I, I think that could be. I think we could be just fine. We might get a, a record Forster, too. you got a set on you not to qualify for this one, then. Um, I think uh, we could end up with a couple wrecks early, but that will take guys out of the contention too, possibly. Of course, this could be messy. Maybe the draft is just going to keep everybody way too close to one another, and uh, did we make a mistake? We'll see. I would I venture to say, to say yeah, yeah, it's set up a little tough. tough. Not necessarily you or him, but <laughs> you gotta trust everybody else around you. All right, let's hopefully get ourselves a good jump. See what we can do. One thing we need to do is not overdrive turn one, that's for sure. Make sure we're braking in time. Green, green, green. Nice car is off. The next car is the leader, outside. Still there. Still there, hold your line. K 
Keep low. Right, keep it smooth. Still there. And we get this position before we get to turn two. Hope the guy backs off, cause got the no, nose. There we go. Who goes to him? I think that's a good idea early on here. Okay, we're getting plenty of break. Get this thing turned. All right. We'll hang on to P3 in the opening lap. The four will take the lead. Yellow and a yellow. They want you in single file. Pit road yeah, is closed right line. now. We think that camera right. has gone off. Get this thing slowed Come down so we're not wasting any tire. Catch up to car. Catch up to him, but I want to save some fuel as well. There's one caution. It's looking like we're burning more fuel than expected as well. Race cars out. Line up single file behind car number zero two. We're, we're gonna have to keep an eye on when closed. we need to fill this thing back up. getting caught back up. Good stuff. We'll save some fuel now. I don't think we're going to be able to save enough, but could afford us more options later. I don't think we're going to be able to save enough, even if we get a couple cautions, because we've got to make up like 10 laps. Hey, Jim, do you use the uh, button caution. Pits are closed. to shift? And those are 10 long laps here. No, I have a... Uh, I use the pedal. Pit road is now open. I'm pretty impressed if you don't mess that up. Catch that too, car. I tried that for a while. I messed it up, so I just deal with auto blip. Catch that too, car. Oh, I do mess it up every once in a while. Hopefully this will be two to green. Bit of a long pace lap here at Pocono, so... Usually in the form I'm missing a shift on a start. Or restart. I don't do it all the time, but... Get the happens. two, car. Get the four, car. <laughs> the two going real hard on the fuel saving. What he's doing is he's avoiding using the brake and letting it roll as much as he uh, can to save that fuel. That's why he ended up so far ahead. He's just going to let the car slow down naturally. Catch the ball, car. Catch the pace, car. I'm just going to stay right here and manage my throttle this way. Tiny bit of throttle and then clutch it when I can. Maybe we would be able to make it if uh, we save hard enough, but I don't know. That just seems like such a long way. Catch that too, car. 
gates are open. Get the four car. We're already almost, uh, we could almost make it to about 41, it looks like, based on current estimates. So we're saving some. We'll be single file Get here. The four car. Get the two car. One left to green. Cause in this lap. All right, we're gonna get back and restarted. We'll have 45 to go when we go green. Hope we don't get too many of these cautions because this takes a while. Alright, maybe a couple more yellows and maybe we can make it to the end if we're real careful with our fuel, but for now we're not going to worry about it. Just going to go back to normal pace. Hopefully get a good view of the four car as it gets us started here. He's hanging back like he wants to get an early jump. See if that's the case. Decent enough. We're basically even with the two, so that's fine. This sucks. Now I gotta pace again. Maybe I was too optimistic. Yeah, I guess I was too. Ah, that stinks. With the number of pace laps, I don't think it's even possible to get 11 cautions, does it? Standing down in one and two. Catch that two, car. I think it's possible. We just might find out. Pace car is out. Line up single file behind car number zero two. Yeah, I guess I've got to catch up. It's closed. Okay, pace car's not that far away. Catch that two car. Man, this stinks. His pace laps are way too long for those cautions to come out that soon. Love to actually do some racing. Of course, I'll have the uh, bookmarks on the video if. Oh my Jesus! All right, then that scared me. He's gonna clean you up. About an inch away from me. I. Me too. Not sure what that's about. He pretty much did the same thing to me. I was like, oh my god. He was just getting in track position. Pass that 20. Oh, car. Canada. Get that two, car. Not sure what that guy's up to. Pace car is out. That was a little close for my comfort, though. I'm flying by while we're pacing. 
road's open. Cross yellow. Pits are open. Reminds me of when the pace car likes to fly by you and it scares you. Except that time, I should have been scared. Cause that guy's not intangible. It's fine. You got loads. Yeah, I doubt that. I don't think even with a full tank we'd be able to make it to the end. Well, it is getting close, I think. Hard to tell without the uh, without the fuel calculator being fully accurate, since we haven't done too many full, well, green laps. Two to green. Couple more miles of pacing, and then we'll be back at it. Eleven, All right, so what, it'll be 41 to go? Yep, 41 to go, and we actually go green this time. We lost a couple Catch more laps of racing. Two, car. Catch that four, car. Half that, 11, car. Pits are open. Everyone doing some saving. I probably should be taking it just as seriously as these guys doing all the tricks and everything. Because they'll probably end up being able to make it while I can't, but... Oh well. I don't know, I... I... I still don't think we can make it though, because I mean, 34 laps, just about, we've got estimated. I think it's actually going to be less than that. We'd need some more yellows to make it possible, I think. One lap to green. Okay, Colton, Line up on get the ready. Race and resume at the end of this lap. Alright, we'll take the short way around the track and then get in line with those guys when we're going through turn three. And nothing more than a Sunday drive here so far, though. Driving on the highway. And our Chevy. 87 Chevy. <laughs> about highway speeds right here, going about 70. Alright, we'll find our place in line now. Let's try this again. Going green. No more immediate cautions, please. It takes way too long to get around here. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green, 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 green. 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 Yeah, making our way to turn one. New fastest lap for Campbell, 104.2. No real reason to try to go for a pass here, we're just going to push it. Oh my god, are you serious?
All right, slow down, guys. Slow down. Well, I apologize for this video already. Hopefully, you're using the bookmarks. <laughs> the chapters, I guess, is what YouTube calls it. Twenty, you need to go by us. The race car's out. Line up single file behind car number zero he blew two. Up. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Do we uh, take fuel now? Is it time to top this thing off? I think it might be actually. I don't want to go back there though, I'll be honest. But I don't think I can make it in fuel otherwise. If we can make it about 40 laps on fuel, we'd be able to make it if we topped it off right now. Two more, and that should be good on uh, fuel. Eleven, car. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. Do we pit here? How many people we got on the track? Pit roads open. Way too Pit many. Pits are open. Path eleven, car. I don't know. I'll pit, I guess, if uh, anyone else does in front of us, but. I don't want to be in the mix back there with whatever they're doing. Some guys back there pitting. Catch the four car. Catch the pace car. Oh boy. This race is going to be more like 30 laps long by the time we actually do some racing. And that's still kind of being optimistic, considering we can't make it through turn one. Getting closer, though, on that fuel count. According to this, we got about 33 laps of fuel left. About five laps Catch short now. Car. I think if we get another yellow, car. maybe we pit, I don't know. But then, maybe we're just going to be able to save enough at this point. If they keep <laughs> throwing the yellows. Catch the two, car. Catch the four, car. More people leaving. Catch the car. Yeah, I think that was maybe the Pits are open. three car leaving right there. Catch the pace car. Yeah. Don't know Where if you got you the finish damage. finish the last one, Jim? I didn't even look. Uh, eight. Was it the damage, or did you just have to start too far back? No, I was pretty much told about where I was. That was about how much speed the car had left in it. Back to one to go. Can we race now, please? One left to green. Please? Race cars coming in this lap. <laughs> if I beg, no can we race? Break. It'll be 40... No, 37 to go. When we go green. So we're about five laps short of fuel.
I don't even know if the three was actually in a wreck because he was listed as not even that far back. Catch that two, car. He might have just got sick of pacing, which you can't really blame him. Let's put some green in, man. Yeah, for real. We'll try it once again. About to go green, stay focused. A little bit of a later star that time, mixing it up. The four is. Again, just gonna stay behind the two for now. No reason to try to make a pass in the tunnel turn right now. He had a really slow tunnel turn, and that's gonna get us passed. Stay high. Clear. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Clear high. Alright, file it in with the 11. The leader has just done a 101.5. That's a new fastest lap for Griffin, 101.3. That lap time was 101.6. That's your quickest lap in this session. Whoa, where's the leader going? Don't expect that. 11's going to the lead. The next car's the we might be able to clear him before the tunnel turn. Oh shoot, he's hitting the wall. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Clear. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. Keep low. Are we shifting in the final corner? Clear. Didn't quite expect Outside. that. Keep low. All right. The well, the not sure what happened there. Really? The guy just closed the door on him. Car outside. Stay low. Clear okay, I guess everybody but me is shifting. I didn't really feel like there was a car out there to stick your nose up there. I thought you were going to try to hit my rear bumper. I wasn't trying to pinch you or anything. I didn't think you were going to try to stick it out of there. I, well, it looked like you missed the shift or something and you were letting me get the high side. And... That was weird. I guess I should be shifting, because these guys are getting much I better runs miss, off. But I thought you were going to hit my rear bumper. I didn't think there was even room out there for you to try to get to the outside. Sorry for trying to do that notion. Definitely wasn't trying to get you running in. <sighs> it wasn't on purpose. It's all good, man. Sliding. Went in a little, a little bit hard. Six is moving his way forward. Like ice skate turn one.
Man, I wish I knew that shifting was a thing, because uh, I haven't practiced it, so I don't really want to mess with it right now, but he's definitely doing better with the shifting. See, as he drives away like that... Maybe it'll be bad for his long run, though. It's already getting on the right rear. We'll see. We're keeping up with him, at least. Laps of fuel. Oh man, we're pretty close. I think those other guys are saving fuel, and that's why they're not keeping up. Which I probably should be doing too, but... I don't know. I just felt like we couldn't make it. Sideways. This shifting's gonna help him get off the corner though. Even though it felt like I was gonna get a really good run for a second there. I'm so scared to try it, because I don't want to shift down to third and then just get kicked sideways. We're even getting green laps. Bad tunnel turn right there. Horrible. Cut down too early. Got too much of a curb. Come back, I need your draft. That was helping me be faster. That lap was a 101.2. The four is back into third place, it looks like. Should we do a wider arc? Better, but I pushed a little bit there, so that still wasn't great. The next car's the leader. He has, so he has himself a little bit of a blink there. He's pulling away, though. see how that works for us. Yeah, could be better. P2. Trouble getting it gripped up down there. Ooh, almost got the wall it looked like ahead.
There, he did get the wall, I'm pretty sure. It doesn't slow him down much, though. Four is coming, I won't fight him too hard. Sliding, ugh. I'm stinking it up in turn one right now. And this thing's tough, especially when you get some laps down on the laps on the tires. Tough to get this thing to do what you want. You can make it to about lap 47, it looks like. Better turn one there, but not as good as the four. Inside. Probably just have to back off for him. Still here. there, inside. Still there. Clear inside. Inside. Oh my god. Sorry, Holton. Still there, hold your line. No pressure, you guys are good. Still there at the bottom. No, you're good, Jim. I probably should have backed off earlier to give you a better angle. I'm sorry about that. Clear. Okay. Yeah, I kind of. I, I didn't mean to get the back you there either, Cole. I was just trying to get low. You're good. We we all kind of just got stacked up. We we made it. All right, so those guys are doing better with their long ooh, with their long run, except for that wall hit just now. But three point five gallons. Three point five gallons is what we would need to save. Apparently, that just seems like so much. I don't know about that, man. Just feeling like we can't save that much. Pass out of the corner, maybe? Going on here for the six? Not quite. Just gonna follow behind him for his draft. Okay, Colton, we're matching race pace. Oh, we're, we're going for it again, I guess. Think about 20 laps of fuel remaining. Sliding down there, that's not good. Holds it together, but he's gonna have an awful run out of the corner. I don't think we're gonna get to him, but. We'll get some time back. Ooh, another big wall hit. He's tearing up the right side of that four car. Guys are shifting. Okay, we're halfway to the finish. Eleven car is dominating. He's having a great run. He's got this place figured out, I guess. Mm, not enough of a run to take it. Uh, on the six, I'm just gonna follow him. Car outside. Shoot. Still there. I don't know what the happened line. there? Clear. Not expecting to get to his inside. Back 
Attacking third. Keep hustling. Attack to third, but I think he's gonna maybe look on us. Yeah, he's gonna get a run. Still there, hold your line. Clear. Learn from what we did last time. He didn't quite get the angle still though. Better. <laughs> Better though. What is our fuel saying? 19. Three gallons. Still short. We're getting closer though, actually. P4, you've just done it. 101.8. Eight. I think we have to try to make it from here. These other guys are probably going to be able to do it. Uh, now it's going back up though. Good run through the tunnel turn there. Last lap time was at 101.4. Ooh. That was probably the biggest wall hit yet for the four, I think, up there. That looked pretty big. Still doesn't lose too much time, though. Some good time right there. Come to 20 to go. And we're three laps short. in that lower line through one. Man, the 11s. <laughs> That's great. He's way out there. I'm impressed. Got some fast guys here battling for second. He's like, nah, I'm gonna lead my own up there. Well done to him. Anybody know where Gen 4 is this week? I'm dead. Thanks. Yeah, I like that Malou line much better. Another wall hit for the four. Getting away with it though. Kind of checking up here in the corner. New 
pass this lap for holder 100.4 zero, zero, seconds. You've just done a 101.5. Getting a little bit too sideways, went through there too fast. Had to chase it up the track, and that kind of messes up my corner. P4. They're side by side going in a tunnel turn. I think the four hit the wall again. Oh boy. Hey, you're feeling Jim's move there. Pretty good race, though. We've had some back and forth, fighting for second here. We've had some green laps finally, which is great. Good consistency. Worried we wouldn't get any for a while there. Another big hit. How many times until that thing falls apart? Slide from the six. Outside. Keep low. We go to his inside. You're back in third. Keep hustling. Stay low. Gonna get a bump draft. That's just part of the four's line, I think, is to hit that wall. More bump drafting. Ugh, terrible. He's gonna come take it right back. Still inside. Clear inside. Inside. Still no there. grip out here. Clear. The answer daily ahead is now 0.3. Seems like no one wants to lead this little group here. And it's really wanting to get sideways through the tunnel turn now. I'm losing track of those guys. I'm just having a tough time holding on to this thing. We're not going to make it to the Your end either. Hmm. Two point eight gallons. That's so much to save. We pit like right now.
Inside. Thinking about my strategy Still and I'm there. not even driving through the corner correctly. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. D5. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Clear inside. The next car is Wallen. Alright, we might pit here. Is that dumb? Probably. I don't think we can make it to the end though. Breaking much earlier. Alright, we're gonna pit in here. Do something stupid. Caution will come out right when we, uh, when we do, I'm sure. Pit lane Not a very good entry. 60 miles per hour. Okay, Colton, we'll fuel you to the end of the race. Pit box team, 10. Five. Three. Two. One. Right here. Man, this thing doesn't like to stop. 86.69. All clear. Punch it. Just a heads up. You know that you only have one set of right side tires remaining. Took right sides. Be fast for a minute. This will be good if they have to pit, but I don't think they do. I just... I don't think we were going to be able to save that much fuel. I don't think we would have from the start. Maybe. I don't know. At some point, though, it became too late, and we definitely weren't going to be able to save enough, so... We'll pit now while we still got some time. We're not going to go a lap down, since this place is so big, so... I ain't trying to do nothing crazy here. It's draft. Car outside. Feel up. Keep low. Clear outside. I'm going to be coming to 10 to go. We're still 10th, which isn't the worst. The gap to pool behind is increasing. It's now 1.3 seconds. It's real loose, though. Heading through the tunnel turn, basically drifted through it there. Okay, we got more people in the pits. At least we're not alone. All right, Colton, you're reeling. Dry gear. <laughs> got Caps ten left to go. You're in the top Peter. ten. So we'll Observe be ninth one, now. Zero, zero, seconds. I think I was kind of right when it came to uh, the cautions. We had a couple really quick ones and was looking really bad, but as soon as we got spread apart, it was fine. Ugh. Loose again. Through there. I gotta calm it down a little bit. Even though I got fresh tires, I can't be overdriving it. That's not gonna be fast at all. I say that, I overdrive a corner again. Cool. Boy, I'll let you go when you get here. Alright, let us go. 
Outside. Outside is clear. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. No problem. Left us a lane down low. That was cool, though. How is this going to turn out? Should be passing the 10 here shortly. Outside. Still there, hold your line. Outside, clear. Oh, we got the 6 in the pits. Okay. Oh, he's coming out right now, though. And he's gonna have fresher tires. So he'll pull away from us. Good to see a mistake, though, uh, as he's getting used to the new grip he's got. We we almost did that. There it is. That was a shifting mistake, I think. I'm not gonna go all the way down there for draft. Captain Daly in front is now 0.6. That lap was at 100.7. Zero, zero, so we'll be seventh place. I feel like uh, the four and the two now. probably can make. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. That I believe was the four. Glad the six is here. We can take some of his draft because I think he's going to be faster than us. Or we'll come out ahead still. And if I could hit turn one more consistently, I think I'd have a much better time. Two, I think. I was thinking the two and the four could make it. The four couldn't. And the two make it. Wheel a little bit. Did the four take fuel only? I feel like he should be driving way more than he is. The captain daily in front is now five left to go. Five to go. I'd love for this to go green. I'm really interested to see what happens. He's still hitting the wall up there. I think he maybe took no tires. He should be driving away from us. And instead we're getting closer. Sure, I'm not putting in very good laps, though. I 
They are side by side up ahead. I think I uh, almost guarantee you that the Ford did not take tires. One for the pass there. This could be dangerous. Oh man, that was close. And there it is. The yellow flag is out. They want you in single file. Pit road is closed. I'll be a son of a bitch. You gotta be kidding me. Catch the four car. Who are at? Catch the ten car. Catch the twelve car. Catch the twenty-two I got in the back of Jim, but he like parked it in the middle of the corner. <sighs> Were you able to make it, Frank? Yep. That brake bias at 42%. Good win, Greg. That was a lot of fun racing, guys. Colton, what car do you normally race? I race just about everything, but my favorites are like the Arca car and the Gen 4. I probably do those the most. Okay, because I see you here every once in a while, and obviously you got good speed, but a lot. Go in, Greg. We're not going to be a green white trigger. Single file behind car 12. We're under caution. It's oh. closed. You've got two laps to go. Only two minutes of damage in this race. You're going in the right direction, Jim. Is there a green white check it or no? Is that it? No. Not up. Up. Catch the 22 car. White checker, no wave around. Well, that stinks. We could have had two more spots there, maybe. But having to slow down for it, car just stepped out from under me. So that sucks. This looked like a ninth place finish. Guys that pitted, you just take fuel only, or you take right side? I didn't take any tires. No whole break. Pit road is now open. It's open. Yeah, that's why I caught you so quick like that. I took right side. Whoa, why is this guy coming yeah, out at me? I figured that would happen. You were catching me pretty quick. I guess I don't go past the 22. I thought I would since he's a lap car. Yeah, I just, I couldn't stop, man. I tried to stay off of you, but there was nothing I could do there. I mean, you kind of, I was going to give it to you, but then it's, I guess you got tight or something. White flag, white flag. Should have gone high. I had had old the fire, outside. but it's all good. It was only one spot. We both finished fifth and sixth, so... Somehow I got the worst out of that. <laughs> trying to, I should have gone high, but I went low, and then my brake bias being at minimum sent me sideways, trying to hit the brakes. But uh, good, good, good racing. Uh, the rest of the race, Ryan, that was a lot of fun. You guys were putting on a show. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. That was a great fun, man. Some of the best stuff I was racing I've had in this car in a while. I haven't been running this lately, and man, this makes me want to run it more. Did anybody else save fuel? I mean, obviously, y'all saw me saving big. I think Brian and Matt did, but they may have pitted. Yeah, we uh, benefited from fuel during that 15 lap grade at the beginning. I was, I had like, I was a lap short, I was trying to save like hell. I think I could have made it, but, you know, it's good race. Sorry again, Jim, about earlier, definitely wasn't trying to put you in the wall. Glad it didn't hurt you too bad. Oh, good, man. Took the fuel and I was four laps to the good. Well, that'll do it here. We'll get P9. Fortunately, get, uh, wrecked. Trying to dodge their wreck. I don't know if I could have gone high, to be honest, because if I try to turn right heading into the tunnel turn, I'm probably going to pancake the wall. Anybody keep up what number, number yellow flag is that? I lost. 
pick that with number six. All right, we'll cross the line and then we'll go back and look at the incidents. Thank you, gentlemen. P9. That's the oh, only fun race we could do. Alright, there's the chicken flag. Catch staff 10. Car. Whoa. Nice run. Sorry, man. Internet. Issues. Right as this thing ends. Catch staff 10. Car. 1. Car. I think I was a little better in 2. You know, always catch me and I'd pull away just a little bit. Cat's freaking out. Um. Yeah, that was fun and I was just man. waiting to see who all was going to pit there. I knew if it went green, me and you and I were good. It was just a oh, matter of the new tires. Safe, safe in front of us. Disappointing, man, but that's why I really want to push it too much behind you. We'll see what all those early cautions were about. Here in lap one, Twenty's getting loose and then out into the outside wall. And that was your first caution. Ooh, that looks like uh, equipment failure. Or the 21, unfortunately. Car stopped turning. And I think this is under yellow. Isn't it? Oh, no. That's just him all on his own way in the back, I think. No, no. It's under yellow. Okay. So, he's just having some issues there. Getting caught up. Oh no. And then again in turn three. Might need a little more practice, it looks like. 18 way overdrives it. These cars are so heavy. You gotta slow it down a ton. Oh, it's got company. So we'll have the 16 back here. Maybe putting a bunch of wheel in it to try to avoid the guy up high and then it breaks loose for him as well. Whoa, they were really close to making contact there. Alright, so getting caught up, but we're going to have another caution, another yellow flag uh, spin here. No, not quite. Don't know why we saw it then. Getting restarted. Let me just let any people by, and then that was a shifting mistake, I guess. And the 16 again. Gonna be spinning. Drives in too hard. Gets on the brakes. Pitches it sideways. And these are very, very difficult to catch once you uh, slide in them. There was another one. Oh, this is what happened to the three. That was an equipment failure. Another one. That's looking like, uh, who was it? Mark Martin, maybe? In the Daytona, in the Daytona race years and years ago, and then getting into Jimmy Johnson or something like that. Someone in Jimmy Johnson involved in it, I think. Where the car just breaks and doesn't turn anymore. Reminds me of that. Yeah, the floor didn't really need to stick his nose there, I don't think. The 11 did have like a, a bad shift, I think, but... There's not really any room up there. The floor being pretty aggressive. Sticking his nose there. And, uh... Ends up kind of in my path, and then that little tiny tap, of course, is a 2x. We end up with 4x at the end of this race. After two, two x's. Eighteen not turning. I think we're into our long run now. Oh! What on earth was that? Oh, a bad shift, it looks like. Going a little bit too fast for the shift, maybe, and, uh... Or shift into the wrong gear or something, because it pitched him sideways. That probably wasn't too good for the car. More wall hits, it looks like. Up 24. 
Just a brush of the wall. Big hit there. The eight gonna spin it. Oh no. That's some heavy side damage there. And that was it. The three comes back out later. So, um, at least we can say uh, we didn't have it quite as bad. The three having the equipment failure. Excuse me. But uh, we'll get ninth. It actually didn't show that late incident. And that final caution. Where would that be? Alright, so what happens here? So I, I felt that was pretty aggressive by the four to kind of cut down in front of the six. I mean, knowing that you've got no tires, I feel like you kind of just got to decide, hey, th this is inevitable. I'm not going to hold them off for three plus laps on no tires after how quickly it caught me. I mean, maybe that's just me, I think. That might just be me, but I think you give them the bottom there. And the 6 isn't ready for how slow he's going to go. So that's what causes that contact. I mean, it looked like to me that 6 was really trying. And speaking of really trying, I'm really trying to slow this thing down. It's looking like they're going to get stuck up there. Like the 6 is going to keep pushing the 4 and they're going to not come down the track. And I'm doing my best to slow this thing down. I can't just slam on the brakes or else it'll break sideways. And the 4 comes down. I try to go to the right, but at this point, after this stab of the brakes, it's already pulling to the left. And uh, they keep going, and I somehow got the worst of it. <laughs> I could have handled it better, I'm sure, but... I mean, up, right here it's looking like, alright, they're gonna... They're gonna stay up top, so I'm going down low. And then all of a sudden, nope, they're going to be down low and the 4 is going to be down low. So I have to hit the brakes hard and uh, the car doesn't like that. Get it going as fast as I can, try to salvage. And we uh, get a ninth place, so I guess it wasn't too bad. We were seventh. We would have been fifth if we were allowed to go past both these guys. But uh, we lose two spots. And uh, could have been worse, I guess. So having seen all that, we'll look at the race results page and wrap it up. We'll lose some eye rating. Maybe safety rating, or we'll stay at the 499. 2378 strength of field, minus 35 in the I rating, and uh, we'll just uh, hold steady at A499. And uh, 92 championship points. Could have been better, but uh, not the worst day on the track, even after uh, a couple little incidents. So that will do it. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Have a good one.